Ferry operator Stena Line says it will be starting the conversion work on its first ferry to run on methanol main engine fuel in January 2015. Stena Germanica, a 240 metre long ship with 4,000 lane metres employed on their Gothenburg Kiel route, will be out of service for around six weeks while the engines are converted at a cost of around 22 million euros. The engine conversion will enable the Stena Germanica to use methanol as her main fuel with MGO, that's marine gas oil, as a backup. Methanol is a clear, colourless, biodegradable fuel that can be produced from natural gas, coal, biomass or even CO2. Methanol plays a key role in the energy sector as a clean and cost competitive alternative and energy resource. Unlike natural gas as an alternative fuel, methanol is liquid at room temperature, so infrastructure costs are lower than LNG. The current world production of methanol is around 55 million tonnes a year, and Stena lines say that engine conversion to methanol is considerably less expensive than conversion to LNG. By using methanol, the emissions of sulphur will be reduced by about 99%, nitrogen 60%, particles 95%, and carbon dioxide 25% compared with today's fuel. So the overall package looks like a good deal for the environment. Stenoline reports that it's running a number of projects to look at other alternative fuels and different techniques for emission purification such as LNG, electric propulsion and scrubbers. But Stenoline's CEO Carl Johan Hagman said it is likely we will use some different types of solutions in the coming years. However, based on the results of the methanol project, we are intending to convert additional ferries. We'll bring you more on this subject as we have it.